This is what an apartment complex looked like last week. Just absolutely devastating right after tornadoes hit Louisville. And this is what it looks like today. The damage is still there, but with blue tarps covering the buildings. About 50 people don't have a home right now. WDRB's Jalen Level caught up with one man who lost everything. One week later, trees are still down and families no longer calling this place home. Many of them still picking up the pieces. It was just ugly. Nam Neal went to bed last Wednesday afternoon. Wind woke me up, looked out the window. Not realizing what he would see or hear. And I just heard that sound, that big crackle sound. And everything that's in my bedroom came towards me. But as he tried to gather himself. Stumbled, I hit my head on the wall. I fell down the steps and I went face first into the door. All during the tornado that shattered windows, destroyed roofs, and tossed trees across the parking lot. I'm in a lot of pain. Physically and emotionally, we spoke with Neil last week during the height of it all. You dodge one thing and, and go into another. <laughs> How are you really winning? One week later, there's a slightly different visual. The cleanup continues. Volume is, I mean, it, it's calls every day, you know, for inspections, things like that. We've probably taken in about five to six large losses, you know, uh, and by large loss, I'd say over $50,000 worth of damage. Meanwhile, the father of three says he has lost everything, lives in a hotel and needs help. But there's one thing he will continue to do. Keep on fighting. Just keep on fighting. As he hopes for better days. That's what that is. Reporting with photojournalist Emily Evans, Jalen Level, WDRB News.